Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Sunken Land. I'm the Radio Man 03. It's awesome to have you along. Downstairs area is cleaned up. The stuff we're selling is in here now. Well, <laughs> you know, selling or just the oddball stuff. Uh, what do I have over here? I've got some more stuff for sale here. And some more stuff down. Nope, nothing down there, but it's ready to go just in case. We've got our water thing, of course, right here that we've been working with. Uh, what else have I gotten taken care of? We did have an attack at the base. These guys were, I don't know what they were. Uh, I don't recall what it said above their heads or anything else, but they were clothed and had crossbows and axes. So I've not seen any of the mutants dressed yet, but I feel like these guys were wearing clothes. That's what it felt like anyways. Uh, I think I found a little more iron. I need to check what's in my inventory right now. Uh, not much of anything. I did do a little diving, a little deeper diving with the uh, stuff, with these air tanks. Uh, I actually found a pipe in the um, apartment complex or whatever. You know what? I'll figure it out. I'll, I'll figure out which one it is and let you guys know. But uh, there was a, there's a, a hole, like an old well that you go down. And there's actually uh, a little something down there to surprise you at the bottom. A nice box. What else did I do? I have uh, the air station up here. I think we had all this taken care of already. Yeah, I moved the metal barrel over here. Our bed is here. I'm going to have to get walls put up. Uh, what else have I got going on? I th do I have iron to cook? I thought I did. Okay, we got some odds and ends in here. I'm going to look at some better weaponry too today. We need to figure that out. I got 10, 11, 12. I'm getting cold. I got 12 metal. That's it. I could have sworn I had iron to cook. Um, well, let's see. Can we sleep the night? I don't know when this is going to pop me up. Okay, perfect. Just as the sun comes up. I'm thinking about just going out and attacking these guys here, too. I'm thinking about doing it. I'm not sure. The, the, the attack we had here at the base, they didn't look like mutants to me. They looked like, um, I, I don't know. I don't know what they look like. They looked like guys that would be out in the desert somewhere is what they look like to me. Uh, so, I don't know. I could, like, take this thing out right here. And I'm pretty sure this thing out right here, too. I don't know if I'm at that point, though. What do we have for the... Where's our our gun bench we put over here? Let's go take a look and see the gun bench real quick. Am I biting off more than I could chew? I don't know. Uh, there's the shotgun, the pump shotgun. I have, I've got a few shotgun shells, but not much. That's only damage 28. Hunting rifle 48, huh? Bolt action. Ooh. Into broken old bolt action. Okay, and gun and eight gun parts. And that's just okay. This is not to, okay. Good. This is to craft it, not to research it. Good. <laughs> I was just checking. Um, you guys also send the comments that this PM pistol's not too shabby. It shoots pretty fast. I don't know that I have the parts for that. I know I've got pieces parts around here. I've got one gun part and I have one broken PM. No, you know what? I've got gun parts someplace else. I know I do. I've seen them. I just have to figure out where I put them. Um, yeah, we've got a few more chests now. That's all metal. Gas is going over there in the flares. Aha, there's three here. Okay, so I've got that, and I also have this guy. Wasn't it that four and one or three and one? Something like that, right? Let's see. Yeah, two duct tape and 15 metal. Okay, so I've got that. The duct tape is right in here. Duct tape and then uh, a little bit of metal. Let's make that gun. I think we've got some rounds for it. We'll see if we can figure out. Ooh, do I have the ammo bench? Let's see something real quick. Uh, we're going to do the ammo workshop. Oh, we don't have the copper ingots. So whatever bullets I fire out of this gun is all we're going to have unless we find some more. we got to get the copper open. That's right. Copper is the next big thing, huh? Uh, that's not too bad. We've got the um, uh, ore detector. We have that. We've got a couple of batteries. So I think we're good to go there. Um, this is doable. We just have to go find that copper again. Yeah, okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make it. Let's craft it. 
35 it holds it uses the pistol ammo i think we should probably keep the other gun on us well we'll have to keep the other gun on us because we've only got so many rounds for this thing and where did i put ammo at uh, hopefully eventually we'll be organized here eventually uh it was pistol ammo right was it over here no oh boy i tell you Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Jeez, radio. Here we go. Off to a start. 16. 16 rounds. That's it. Hmm. From what I understand, you can really pop some rounds off of that thing right there. So, the attack, back to the attack at the base, too, now that we've got that uh, pistol made. We'll hold on to that. You know what? Maybe that should be our backup gun. We'll take this one and hold on to that for our backup, just in case. Uh, let's put it in... Let's put it in this chest over here. I really need to get the walls put up around here. I'm going to drop that in there and, and that in there. So, does it come loaded? It looks like it comes loaded, huh? What does it say in there when I hold it? Yeah, it comes loaded. 12 rounds, right? Okay. So we got two clips. A total of two clips and a little bit of extra. Should we go over there and pick on those guys? I feel like I need to find iron too. Like iron is super important that I get that going again. Again, I really thought I had um, another five or six ingot to smelt up. And I want to get back to talking about the attack that occurred here, too, because I'm not 100% sure, but I, I think they went through the walls. It got to me through the walls. <laughs> I tried fighting from this room right here. This is where I was trying to do my fighting. I need to replace this with a window, and this needs to be a window, too, uh, so that when they're running around out here, I could shoot at them. But as I was fighting from the windows I could fight from, somehow somebody got in here and... Uh, uh, hit me th two three times and I was dead. So I don't know how they managed to get in here. Uh, the doors were closed But anyway, so I'm kind of curious to see if something like that's gonna happen again The way they hover and stuff and float when they're jumping is kind of odd and unusual So hopefully they get that worked out pretty quick. I don't like them being able to Teleport through my walls and and get to me in there. What's the what's the point then right? What's the point? Gonna be on the shelf here, huh? I can't remember quite where we found it last time. I remember we had the hammerhead sharks, though. I do remember that. Could be right down here. Okay, this is it right here. Uh, let's go. Let's put this down here. There we go. Sharks. If there were, they could have eaten me by now. Let's just see if we can find it first. I was wondering, can you put flags underwater? I'm assuming this stuff kind of respawns, right? Maybe? Copper? The nodes? I feel like they do. It takes a while, but eventually they come back. I wonder if you could put a flag down here underwater. I don't think I can actually... I don't have what I need. That's one of the things I was wondering about. So, yeah, I need some wood and some cloth, and this place has been picked over pretty good, so I don't think it's going to be here. So let's see, what do we got for copper now? That away, huh? That away! All right, let's get back to the boat. We got some iron up ahead here. I see the sulfur. Uh, the last thing I'm going to grab is that iron. It's right there. I see it. I see it. 
I'm going to take this iron and dedicate it complete to getting the foundations. Now, the characters, when they arrived and started attacking the base, they focused their attention a lot on those foundations. The, the Actually, the upgraded foundations. They picked on those more than they picked on anything else. That's what they were after. Let's check number five. Huh. Like the ship put the brakes on right there, big time. You know? Big time. Cook it, cook it, cook it, cook it. All right, what else do I have on me? I got metal, and I got all kinds of great stuff. Metal, 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 metal. That's beautiful stuff right there. And this is all the other great stuff we have right there. I got a bunch of iron on me. That's sweet. Okay, that's really awesome. I'm happy about that. Very happy about that. I don't know how the wood's doing on these. I need to get some wood. Let's do that. The machinery is very awesome. I like the fact that it works. I like the fact that the pressure gauge actually moves up when you're filling the tank and you have to fill the tank. I think that's kind of cool. It's really busted down, man. You would need gallons of WD-40. Matter of fact, this place would probably dissolve if you did that. <laughs> it'd just disappear, you know? It'd be funny. Well, I don't know about funny, but, you know, it'd be pretty good. Uh, I got wood, iron, okay, beautiful. We got ingots already. Boink and a boink. Uh, that answers my what? Oh, I should have I forgot to click a second time. All right, so we got the uh, we got that coming. Where's that copper at? Uh, oh, uh, let's see here. Where's the cop? There's the copper, and give me the metal, the metal, the metal, and the metal. And I could take. Let's take that wood out of here too. We'll go fill everything up with a little bit of wood too. It's important to keep the wood going. You were empty. Okay, you are no longer empty. We've got nothing else downstairs now that actually is going to need anything like that. That guy doesn't need anything. There we go. Double that. And then we've got our kitchen here. What do we got in here? We've got 10, we got 10 wood. And we got 10 in there. Alright, beautiful. We're, we're looking good. We've got our stuff taken care of. I believe I'm putting wood in this barrel over here. I'm a little concerned that they could break shoot break some break this stuff and shoot it. I probably I don't I just don't want to spend my metal on those walls. I don't. Maybe I'm being weird about it, but I just don't want to spend my money on it. I want to keep this metal for um I guess the floors and making the bullets and, and all that stuff and some of the decorative things and of that nature, you know? Okay, so we got two of the copper done. Uh, very good. We got, we could, yeah, I think we did, did pretty good on that loot run right there. That's one of my better loot runs, actually. I picked up quite a bit of stuff. At least I feel like I did. This chest is full of metal, which is great. And you are going to start getting filled up with metal. And the wood. Let's replace this one first. I found myself on this side of the building fighting on a regular basis. They attacked from this direction in the water and they kind of kept themselves to this corner except for the ones that got up here and drifted into the building. I'm hoping that having Solid walls will deter that from happening anymore. Let's go in here. Let's let's try to get a couple, maybe a couple more of our walls taken care of. See, some of the stuff is some of the stuff is damaged. I, I went around. I thought. There we go. Okay, and then let's go to build, and we're gonna put a reinforced window there instead. I'm pretty sure we'll be getting attacked. Um, and let's do this one over here too. We've got iron. We've got one more piece in our pocket here. Let's do that. We'll do that one there. I don't know why I put this here. That was stupid. <laughs> this is right in the way of where I'm going to fight from. Actually, you know what? I've been going out here and just having them chase me back and forth on the dock. And I've been killing them that way. Uh, sometimes you can get pretty lucky with the spear. And if I remember, I try to block once in a while too. It's a unique idea. To block <laughs> but yeah it's uh, blocking is is a good thing let's go ahead and um, do I have any more iron on me I don't I've got more to cook though I probably shouldn't leave those doors open I 
can't say I found any big orb deposits again. It's all been about five now, it seems like. They all give about five. Okay, there's no more copper here. What about iron? All right, let's put that away. Let's go get the iron. I think I want to go do that. I think if I stay focused on that stuff, I should be able to get it put together a little faster. It's just easy to get lost in these um, these POIs and just go out and, and do that constantly. Oh, oh, I got no air. Air, 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 air is good for me. I need air. Oh, okay, there we go. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and swap that tank out. Ooh, I was not paying attention, obviously. That hurt. Ouch. My air tanks are empty. I'm on my own now. I think this is the last one in the area here. This has actually been a really good spot. I'm near the mansion right now. The sharks that are by the mansion I see them but they're not bothering me at all there's been a bunch of iron right in this area though here where are we at uh, we got district 43 up there trading outpost and small rock island kind of right in the center here is been quite a bit of iron located in these rocks so eventually I gotta imagine that they'll come back and it'll be another spot we can come and harvest some more of that later hopefully uh, in the meantime, I'd like to get home and get some of those defenses put together and figured out. You know what? I'm going to stop by here and chop down all of her trees and get all that wood, too, and bring that with me. We're going to need that to uh, uh, make the stuff I want to make. So we'll take that wood with us, too. I know. You like it? Oh, man. We are iron gathering crazy sons of guns today, man. We're getting it together today. Just the one nugget, huh? Hmm, I wonder if maybe it doesn't respawn but one every now and again instead of the whole lot. I don't know. Here's one of the bushes back. But it looks like it's going to take a lot longer than I would expect it to to get the resources back. The lemon bushes and stuff. These guys are back. I noticed that. There's always like a couple of these guys back on the island. I thought they had said, too, that there were going to be crabs at each island, too. Uh, at least one or two crabs. I found as many as three on that little island we started out on. I think instead of a window here, I'm going to use a solid wall since I have that uh, uh, device sitting there. <laughs> I've got the uh, thing with Bob here, too. Uh, nope. There we go. We'll get that out of here. Okay, so this whole bottom floor now is um, metal up. All the walls are metal. I think I probably should do... I don't know if the shutters are really necessary. I don't know if they are. Uh, let's grab a little bit of metal. We'll finish those up. Uh, I probably should sleep the night away if I can. Here we go. Let's grab a little bit of metal. And let's go to build, and we will look for that, uh, where's that shutter? There it is, right there. I gotta make sure it doesn't already have one in it. Okay, I can't open the door unless, okay, never mind. Do that, that, that. Yeah. That is good. Part of me wants to fill this in with these walls right here, just like that, all the way around. Okay, the other thing we're looking at is the defenses that we tried before. <clears throat> the spikes with the, uh, the metal, the wood spikes. Those take a lot of wood, and they take the regular metal. Once they're gone, they're gone. So, uh, the resource is gone. That's my thing with that, is that once these are broken, it's they're just gone. You can't get them back. Um, 
I think I'm going to throw up a couple metal walls here in this corner just to kind of keep this protected a little bit better. These guys um, they start coming in with some heavier guns, I think. So I want to make sure I'm not getting my stuff that I worked so hard to grab damaged. I feel like I should have windows maybe on this corner and not put anything else in this corner. So I've got an area to come over here and shoot downwards if I need to. I'm going to do that. This could be a good spot to stand. Although, I wouldn't doubt that they aim at the floor and shoot the floor out from underneath me because it is uh, less hit points. We'll have to see. Uh, build. And we want to do these guys right here. We'll open them right now, but yeah, they were they were down here. Now I can't see too well, of course, directly below me. But again, it seemed like it was a pretty good idea to fight them from uh, the dock and just keep moving around the building. They would jump in and out of the water, and the more they jumped in and out of the water, the less they spent time banging on something. So as long as you kept them moving, things stayed together. As soon as you stop moving, somebody down here sees you fighting, they just start banging on the platform. That's what they would start doing. Uh, how does that look up there? Eh, not too shabby, huh? Looks pretty good. How much metal do we have left? Uh, three more, huh? Well, we should do this then for sure. Um, I'm thinking here we've got chests there, so I should probably do that guy right there. This is both the forges, so let's go also go... What, I got two left? I got two left. I'm going to demolish that one. Demolish that one. And we're going to put those two up as well. Those are going to be solid walls also. There we go. And let's get some... Let's get some of these guys. Let's get this guy here and this guy here. I'm not sure if maybe they broke those out or if I forgot to put those in. But there we go. We got like that. Now, I could eventually punch a hole here and have a second uh, layer of decking here to, that I could stand on to shoot downwards as well. That could come. Let's go ahead and... Oh, I've got no more metal. Okay. All right, that's good. That's fine. That's fine. We did pretty good there. We've got a few things actually put up. Build, defenses, um, wall spikes. What does this thing do? How do you even place this thing? Oh, does it swing down? Like whoosh, like here? Oh, well, we gotta try one of those. What the heck, why not, right? If I do that right there, is that what it does? <laughs> I don't even know if that's right. I gotta close that window up there. I, I guess I haven't finished this yet, have I? I still have to get these guys metal here, too. <laughs> Duh. No, the bottom floor is not all metal yet. Yeah, I'm, I'm wondering if that swings down and smashes them. <laughs> if it does, and it works, that'd be cool. If somebody's standing here fighting me, or, or is it supposed to go underneath it? It's it's tough. I, I don't know. Build. Um, is it supposed to go underneath here? You put it there, too. Uh, uh, that doesn't make any sense. I know this is something they're going to be working on extensively. Uh, we'll leave that up there. I don't. I don't even know if that works. The thing is, is I don't know if any of this stuff works. If it causes them damage or not. This I like the fact that it now snaps here like that. That is perfect. Thank you. Yeah, that one's got three crabs on it this time. So 
So I grabbed a little bit of wood, a little bit of strawberries. Those are back too. The mushrooms are back here, so I've been picking those up. It seems like there's a few more popping up than there used to be on the island for the first time. I want you. Thank you. Okay, so we got that whole side. I'm going to come down this way too first. Let's, let's keep going this way. Oh, please, 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 please. I just need a few more. Uh, okay. Wood. I'm gonna go chop down a tree. I don't care. Now nah, I'm just gonna go chop one down. <laughs> I'm just chopping you down because I can grow you later. You, you're no, you're not the one. I'm not gonna chop that one down. I'm chop this one down right here. Now our platform is all metal. Uh, maybe I should put this. I don't have a door on the other side, so there's no reason to have it on the other side. I'm thinking about changing this up again and taking this out. Take this out, take this door and turn it into maybe uh, a wall or something. I don't know. There's, It's nice having options on different ways to get in and out of this building. Okay, so we are completely surrounded by these spikes. Completely. We've never been completely surrounded by the spikes. So, this is, uh, this is a good thing. This is a good thing. I think I should take this out of here. And this out of here. Yeah, I can't... F I could shoot through windows, but you can't, f you know, stab through windows. So I don't know what to do about that. It's kind of nice just having that little outcropping right there with that. It gives you a little something so that you can fight somebody in the doorway without... Like if there's a guy here shooting this direction here, he's going to have to come around and get in front of this door in order to hit you. Because you've got a wall there. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and put a window here. Look at that. Okay. We'll do a window here too. There we go. What if we do... Missing the wood. Okay, yeah, wood's gonna be my wood's gonna be my uh, enemy here. <laughs> the duck pops me right up. Figures. Uh, I think I could get the box and probably move that. But if we put those along here, then you can see it's really gonna make it difficult for them to be able to get up there. You know what? I could stack them up right along here. I could put one here, and then I could take this guy and I could put him. He was already empty, by the way. Put him right up on top of that because we could stack the boxes, the crates. It's really hard to get yourself lined up perfectly with it. So I'm going to do just a little crooked, you know, just like that. I think that looks kind of natural. Do that and then we'll throw, we'll start throwing the stuff in there like so. And then that's the stuff we'll take with us. Uh, that's the stuff we have to sell. What else do I need to do? I th think I've got us kind of an order down there now. A little bit of order. I was kind of hoping I was holding out for an attack to see if an attack would occur. And so far, no. We don't have any kind of an attack. Do I want to go check out that island and see about attacking them? That, that worked. He's dead. Oh, no, he's not. Oh, I see. He crouched down. Oh, he's backing away. Look at that. Rubber Duck Island. Oh, he ducked. He dodged. Right in the gut. 
Okay, he's down. This looks like a potato. You brought a stick to the wrong fight, sir. Oh, that's a machete. Oh. Oh, someone's got a gun. Somebody else got a gun. Oh. Heard that go off my helmet. There, thread the needle, baby. Oh, you're a nice shot, lady. Medicine. Got some rounds on her. Copper. I see it. Cotton, too. Ooh, cotton and copper. It's a copper cotton mountain. Okay, I can't hit him from here with that. Let's put him, let's, let's give him a little bit of s s some nice damage here to the head. He's going to stand there and take it like an idiot. You call yourself AI, sir? Right in the crotch. Right in the head. You ain't no AI. Ooh, that's a nice club. Pick off these guys. Just standing there like dorks. What you got for a weapon, buddy? Oh, he's got a stick, too. Let's go kill him. He's just got a stick. Come on, stick man. Well, that's right. Well, there you go. You just walk right into the bullets. There you go. You're a genius. All right. Did I get everything? I did. A guy over by a squad car over there. Is it just the one left? These guys are easy, man. Pew! I'm up here. Like Batman. What are you? A vengeance. I'm pushing F. Nothing. Well, look at there. Oh, there's another bandit. Bandit, 12 o'clock! Gotcha, bandit. Can't see me. Uh-oh. Nope, can't see me. It's a big old gunfight going on in the Wild West. Hiding behind a rock. Oh, pew! <laughs> nice shooting, Tex. Oh, you walked into that one, sucker. All right, let's get him with the old bow, the old crossbow. Oh, he's fit. Oh, he felt that one. <laughs> oh. The music's back to being pleasant again. There is no more danger. Maybe not. Let's get this gun loaded. Give me that cotton. Give me that there cotton too. Where's this guy at? Where's his guts? He's right over here. Oh man, there's a bunch of ore here. This is like big time ore island. Where did that guy go? He was hiding this here bush, I thought. Or near the bush. Oh, there he is. There he is. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay, so let's go ahead and eat. There we go. What are you guys anyways? I don't even know what these guys were. <laughs> marauders. Oh, God. Marauders now. 
Well, we're going to have to deal with marauders. We got copper and iron all over this island. This is going to take a tick to get the stuff off of this thing, for Pete's sake. That's a lot of stuff. So we've got a little bit of wood. I think I might be able to get another barrier put up in this corner. Crouching down behind that rock really worked well. He could not get to me. You know that? He couldn't get to me. Go build. Can I actually put another one of those up here? Defenses. Is it here? It's defenses. Here we go. What am I doing? Barricade. Build. And I'm going to turn this one around so I've got this low edge here kind of in the corner. If I can intersect them a little bit, that's probably okay. Like that. Now if I come over here and I crouch, maybe that duck will help a little bit. I can pop up and pop back down again, you know. Choo, take a shot. Come back down, reload, all that good stuff. Granted, of course, they could get along here and get get to me, but uh, it, it seems to be something. Like, that's something I could do. Uh, I can't take anything off that chest. Okay, let's go ahead and go back up here. Where's my ladder? What's on the other side? I'm thinking of the old base. <laughs> There it is. Okay, that is going to have to wrap up today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share. I am the Radio Man 3 I want you to have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day. And I do look forward to talking to you again next time.